Well, hey everybody, it's been a while since I made a video. I went through this thing with YouTube and, uh, well, they, they almost took my YouTube channel away. They literally suspended me f from uploading videos for three months. <clears throat> well, I managed to keep the channel and I still can't live stream that that function was supposed to come back uh, all of my videos are demonetized otherwise um, I was told to <laughs> I was told to make a bunch of them private and um, so that's self-censorship so I'm starting back uh, doing the thing that uh, <laughs> I never do. I always um, seem to not want to work out in cold weather. Well, as you can see, I got a winterized, uh, really nice biking jacket. And uh, so it'd be a shame to go to waste. <laughs> And I got these car hearts. You can see what the bottoms are. I got my tennis shoes on. But this is a pair of car hearts I've had for years. Look, I used to work out in this cold ass weather. When I grew up, um, I started working when I was 17. And I mean, maybe that's why well, there's a lot of reasons why I don't like the cold weather. I'll give you one example. The type of injury that I've got to my back from uh, having a fall in 2005, I tore my knee up, and when I twisted, I messed up my back and way down in the S5. L4 region and literally I've taken almost I don't even know the exact time frame but I'll tell you later about it but I've put a stop on working out for a while so it's been almost two months two and a half months oh man the middle of November no middle of October November December it's been too long so I'm back to working out I'm gonna do my best to stick with this it's not no New Year's resolution it's a buddyism uh, the buddyism was that I've been planning this in my mind for two months how I was gonna do it I didn't even have a clue but uh, so I got the car hearts out and that was step one Step two to see if the jacket would fit over it. And step three, what I'm gonna do if I need gloves. I don't have gloves on because this damn video recorded, but I got them in my pocket. Uh, so, it's so freaking cold I can't even think. All right, what I was saying was this. I worked out in this stuff for years. That's why I got these car hearts. These car hearts are from like 1997. I was on a job in Yazoo, Mississippi, and it, I mean, I had a job shack with no heat in it. I was a, a superintendent on that project, believe it or not, and so I had a budget, and <laughs> the owner wasn't going to, you know, the, you know, the construction owner wasn't going to do anything to get me no heat, so I had to go into... Yazoo City to get some supplies and I walked over and looked at these Carhartts and I said wow these are Polar Carhartts these things would keep me warm and I bought them on his ticket <laughs> well he's seen the ticket you know I mean it took a couple months but I was there all winter and I needed these things so when he finally seen he seen me wearing them and then he he realized he never did put heat in that job shack so, so when he seen the cards, he said, "Well, I see you bought you some car hearts." 
I said, yeah, I bought them with your money. Are you all right with it? He said, yeah, I'm all right with it. You didn't mess no days cause of cold weather. But uh, let me think. When I was working on the Greenville Bridge job, 2005, it it was not really cold, but it was spring, and it was still, you know, still cold to me. But uh, yeah, I've avoided the cold weather for quite a while. Long story short, if you watch this video up to now, you're a really true friend. Like and share. Like and share this video. You're a really good, you're a really good friend of mine. And uh, what was I going to say? It's so damn cold, I can't think. Okay. There's the OC. I'm going to be doing stuff in the OC when they open up tomorrow. What was I going to say? <laughs> okay, long story short, if I stay off exercising for too long and the weather gets cold like this, I go to hurting. I go to hurting so damn bad I can't stand it. It's a type of uh, nerve damage down my left leg. It gets really bad. I have to start, which I've already been doing for two months to kind of help it. I practice yoga in the mornings before I even get out of bed. It's a type of yoga that I I, I do from uh, the bed position. And then once I get up onto my feet at the foot of the bed, I got several moves and procedures I do to loosen myself up. So this has been a long ass video to get to this, this view. <laughs> Now, I promised myself I'd go to the bridge and uh, not running, not walking fast. I'm just walking right now. Okay. Ah, look at the water. It's up because of the rain. So, F YouTube, F monetization, my channel. Ah. I can still help other people with their YouTube channels. I can convince them that, uh, you know, I know how to make money with YouTube because I got records and captured images that show that I was making good money before they censorship my heavily monetized, demonetized my site and had me self-censor, I don't know, damn near half a million view videos probably all together about 20. This is the fourth purge that they've done me like this. Kicked me all the way down to nothing. Well, at least I'd, I didn't lose my channel and I didn't lose the bulk of my video videos. But uh, how controversial do I want to be in the future about the things I want to tell you and show you what this matrix is? I'm not letting nothing stop me. This is, God dang it, this is 2019, and this is the first day. My plan is every day do something that my future self will be proud of me of for. And at the same time, get back into shape so when the spring gets here, I'll be doing them 100 mile bike rides and I'm going to break my all-time yearly record this year, 2019. Last year, I almost beat the year before, but I didn't. And one of the reasons I didn't is because I quit riding and as soon as it got cold in the middle of October. This year, I'm going to start early and I'm going to finish late. I'm looking at trying to knock out 10,000 miles in one year. So keep coming back to my channel like this video subscribe leave a comment I hope I can help other people live out their dreams and their ability to do whatever they want to do because I'm gonna do what I want to do thank you